Oh my God, there's fish boiling everywhere here. Look at that. <laughs> I'll tell you what, if that's any indication about what the day is going to be like, stick around. Lake Mateo's bass fishing coming right up. Toyota Truck presents Fish TV in High Definition. Brought to you in part by Mercury, number one on the water. And Rapala, crafted from experience. With your hosts, Leo Stakos and Ron James. Did you see that guy go, buddy? Oh, nice Big one, fish. Leo. Nice one. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. Oh, that's a giant. Oh, that's a pig. <laughs> nice. He's a giant, buddy. Look at this. Oh, yeah. Get him, get him. Oh, oh, look at him. Look at him. Look at him. Oh, look at him. He can't even jump. He's so big. <laughs> Got him, Brent? Oh, that's a start ah, right there, buddy. Oh, look at that. Now that's the way to start us off. I'm welcome to the show. I'm Leo Stuckles. And I'm Grant Mills. And I'll tell you what, you can't see him yet, but if you turn to your right, our good buddy Ron James is with us. He decided to take a break and let us have some fun here in Lake Mateo. That's Mateos a beauty, bud. Buddy, that's a beauty right there. Isn't that nice, Ronnie? That's what it's all about right here in Lake Mateos, guys. A nice eight pound largemouth on a buzz bait. Nice. <laughs> oh, man, what a pig. That's a good one, Leo. Get her back in the water there. See you later. Wasn't that fun? Oh yeah, let's go get some more, bud. <laughs> and we're sitting in about 22 feet of water now. It's amazing how quick the water comes up here. It's just, we got 22 feet of water, and we got four feet of water right up against the shore there. Oh, there we go. There you go. <laughs> nice. Right by that cover, eh? Right beside the cover, Grant. Come right out of it. I got to tell you, man, when these fish come up after it, they come up after it. You know, it's real important to work these areas tight, because if they don't want to move, these fish, they just will not. They're stubborn. Feel how warm that fish is, Grant. <laughs> wow. You think the water's warm here, Leo? Just a little bit. Did you see the size of that thing? Oh! Grant, that was huge. Stinger hook and all. And he didn't get it. Now open that gap, that loop, yeah. Look at these guys. Two guys in a boat, they're all tangled up. You think they were pros or something? <laughs> It's a little different here, though, than your average uh, Ontario lakes that we're used to fishing. We, we would never be fishing 80 feet of water right beside a bank. These particular areas here, there's always one big fish that owns the point. So never pass up a point and make a, a lot of different casts. Just because you, you don't get one in the first few casts doesn't mean it's not going to go. It might be that you're, they're just not ready to go. So it might take that extra little enticement to get them going. There we go. Oh. Just pounded on it, buddy. See how, how tight that oh, was? Oh, I know, I know, I know. He doesn't even come up yet? Nope, he's a good one. Oh, nice. <laughs> <laughs> Look at him, just digging away there. That's just gorgeous. Come on, one more jump on you, buddy. One more jump. Oh, man, it doesn't get any better than this. I got to tell you, folks, when you get out here, oh, there you, are. you are going to experience some of the best fishing in the world here at Lake Mateo. Think, you think this guy's been eating? Oh, look at him. Look at the belly on him. Oh, man. I'll tell you what, Grant. You owe Ron big time for letting you fish today. <laughs> oh, I know. I can't thank you guys enough for uh, getting me down here. This, this place is fantastic. The fish here, quality, quantity, hospitality. There's no better than this place, buddy. In fact, we're going to do that one more time. All right. See you later, And let's buddy. hope it's on the end of my line this time. Look, look, look. Look at him. Look, look at him. Oh, oh God, there he goes. He just, he, he tells everybody where to cast so he can throw you off your game. Yeah. And, and, the, and, then, and, then he, and then he makes his own cast. Yeah, he tries that. He's tried that with me. After the years I get onto it, yeah. I'm trying, I'm leaving him with the best water. Grant, you'll cast. get used to it, bud. Just fish your own game, buddy. I know, that's what I'm trying to do, buddy. Yeah, fish your own game. <laughs> All right. I know. You I, fish I, your I, own here. game and just make sure you're ready with the net. <laughs> It's amazing how these fish will sit 
in a few inches of water. Oh, right up against the bank there, Leo. Like, it's unbelievable. You cast three inches from the bank and you see him move. Well, you saw, you saw that one you spooked earlier. Oh. He took off like that in a hurry. Look at that. Nice see those shot. ones move there? That's good. Now you're casting right. You mean to tell me I was casting wrong? You were right? casting wrong. <laughs> oh, there oh. we go. There we go. Look at this. You keep casting what you yeah, want, buddy. I know. Yeah, well, I was going to be casting there. Oh, sure. <laughs> here we go. That's a wiener. Yeah, just a little guy, but he, he came up and ate it with a, in a hurry. Oh, look where I got him. Right underneath it. You know, it's a good idea to run a, a trailer hook here because it hit with such authority that you don't know where they're going to be hooked. They just come up and smash it. Did you just miss one, Grant? Ha, ha, ha. Look at that tilapia down there, oh my god, minnows, like hundreds of them, little tilapias. There he goes. Got him? Good one, Ron. Excellent, look at that. Oh, it's a tilapia. What? Big tilapia. Oh, it's a big tilapia. Look at this. Wow. Come on, are you kidding me? The guide's dinner. Oh, he's going to love you for that one, Ron. Oh, look at that. Look at that. He's going to love you for that. <laughs> at least I can hook the tilapia. I'm gonna give that to our guide. You know what, Ron? You seem to hook a tilapia every time we come here. That's the biggest one I think I caught. That's, yeah. a, that's a nice one, man. That's a nice meal right there, bud. Oh, yeah. Grant's got a large boat, probably. Oh, yeah. Big fish. Oh, look at the size of this guy. The big, large boats are feeding on these tilapia. Nice that's fish, a nice fish right there. Oh! He almost, he almost got another tilapia called Leo. When you come to Mateos, there's a lot of tilapia nets, and that's a way a lot of them will make a good living tilapia fishing. When you do come down here, make sure that you respect their way of living. I'll tell you what, Ron, they certainly work hard, that's for sure. Catch them another one for dinner tonight. I tell you what, you know what I'd like to do? I'd bring my kids down here to see how hard these people work. And get them off that whatever they're playing on that television. It drives me <laughs> nuts. <laughs> oh, it's another tilapia. <laughs> get them in, get them in, get them in. Tilapia for the guy. There's yeah. dinner. It's almost like a saltwater fish, eh? Yeah, yeah they look but nice. But it's fresh water. Look at the way the, the, the fin goes all the way to the tail. Look, look at these fins, almost like, like an angel fish. Yeah. Hey? Well, I'll tell you what. Are they cool like, or before what? Before you leave, we'll be eating tilapia. <laughs> How do you say you're welcome? Mm -hmm. Donata. 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 You know, folks, we just pulled up into a, a local guy that's doing this fishing, which is hard work. Here, look, he's got another tilapia right now. And you'll notice that the nets catch tilapia only. We've never seen a bass in the net. I haven't, but they're designed to catch tilapia. It's a hard way to make a living. He's got a lot of net to check, and uh, we've seen him pull out two, three tilapia. He's probably got about 30 in there in his pocket. First cast with a, with a spinner. Bring him around this side, buddy. You're not feeling it, you said. I'm feeling it. There you go. Oh, still there, big boy. Yeah, I'm not feeling it. First cast after he says that. You know, Leo, we, we moved back in here, and uh, I turned around and looked at the depth finder, and it was only three and a half feet back there on the point, but now we're back in eight feet of water. And I know you were commenting uh, that I'd said that I wasn't feeling it, because <laughs> I, I thought we were getting in a little too shallow of water. And uh, I took the next cast, and sure enough, boy, there he is, right on it. One thing that uh, Ron and I have learned, always trust the guides. They really know their stuff. Yeah. Not a monster, but definitely a nice fish. I'm happy with it. I'll tell you what, Grant. I've been here six times, and every single time it's a different lake. You know, any, any spot. I tried to GPS some, some spots with my Garmin, so I, I had them for the next time. The spots that I GPSed were in the middle of an island. <laughs> here today, gone tomorrow. Yeah, it's yeah. amazing. The, wa the water changes so fast here. That's why you have to make sure you get a variety of different baits. You know, the one time we came here, we got them all on swim baits. Another time, we got them on buzz baits, top waters, chug bugs, spinner baits. That was another time. You got to make sure you're versatile and you adapt to the fishing conditions. Right now, we're working this dirtier water here in about, now the Garmin says we're in about seven feet of water. And we're just trying to catch the break here. I'm working the top water on the inside. Grant's doing the break with a spinner bait. But, you know, you really got to figure these fish out. There are high times and low times, but 
structure, structure fish are always on all day long. If you can find the structure, you'll find the fish. Got one. Yeah. Oh, you got on the outside. Oh. Hey, you're supposed to be camera guy today there, Ronnie. It's about time. <laughs> oh, yeah. Nice. Yeah. Grande. No, not that. He was all <laughs> over that. Did you see that thing come out of the water? Wow. You see that, folks? That's what Mateo's fast do. Burn ya. <laughs> <laughs> Did you get a bite? Yeah. There he is. Got him he this time. Back for it. He came back for it. Oh, that's a good one, too, bud. Here he comes. He's coming up. Oh, he ate it. He's not coming off. Oh, nice fish, bud. He's not coming off. He, he, yeah. got, he got the hooks in that one. Boy, he bumped it first. I slowed it down a little bit, bumped it again, and then he bumped it again and <laughs> come to Papa. You're doing all right there, Milzy. Ah, gotta like it, Lake Mateos. On that new uh, Terminator, eh, with the single, oh, yeah. single blade. Folks, I'll tell you what, we're fishing some dingy water here. We're just on a, a point with some boulders down here and sticks and that. Picked up on something there yesterday. Slow rolling, spinnerbait, big blade on it, lots of thump, lots of vibration. And I'm quite sure the, pit, the fish are picking this up from, you know, maybe 10, 12 feet away. And they're actually coming looking for it. And they're biting it. And that's the result right there. Lake Mateos. See you later, fella. Look at him. <laughs> oh, good fish, too. He's a good one, too. Oh, look how many times that's Oh, nice. Down. You stole my fish. You're stacked in there like cordwood. Come here. How skinny that fish is. Wow. Oh. All that sunny water we just fished, Leo. We come around the corner here, find a little bit of shade, and Leo says, oh, we're gonna get a fish, we're gonna get it over there. He gets one on, loses it. I throw back in, and there's your result. Another fish I under the shade. more fish there, though, man. Mm -hmm. I think there probably is. You know, we'll, we'll go past it, turn around, and cast back to it, maybe. Portions of Fish TV are sponsored in part by Toyota Truck, Never Quit, and Coffee Time, where coffee time is any time. Oh, right in that shell. Look how shallow that fish was. He wasn't getting off, I'll tell you that much. I hit him right after he sucked it in. Look at the power on this guy. Look at, he just finished eating off that point. Look how fat he is. Look at it. Nothing like buzz bait fishing in the morning. Just beautiful. Watch it. You ready? Say hello. Say goodbye. That's a good one. Nice. Oh. Nice. He came flying out of that tree, bud. This will be interesting. You can tell they just finished eating. Oh, yeah. And he's sitting there now. He's just letting it regurgitate in his gut. His That's buzz. a Lake Mateo's bass right there. Your buzz bait was dessert. <laughs> See you later. Go, buddy. Out of that bush, out of that bush. Get him out, get him out, get him out. Oh, he's got me. I up. told you. He got off. Oh, he got off. But Jump. you got a hook in that thing? Look at the boil on this. Oh! oh! You're all wrapped up here. Look at this. Nice, nice. <laughs> Look oh, at him. He ate that eat. thing. He munched that thing right down. Oh, man. Nice fish, buddy. You think he wanted that, Grant? Oh, I think. Let me just turn us around. Look at that. It Hold just on. fell right out. Beautiful, bud. Right on that point, eh? Got him. Look at that. Never pass up a point here on Mateos. There's always one that owns it, and he just inhaled it. I just said to you, coming up here, I said, man, we're going to get a big fish off that point. And sure enough, look at shallow, that, Shallow, eh? shallow water. Three feet of water. You know, what is this guy doing in three feet of water? Just amazing. you got to get out here and try this guy. It is absolutely incredible here. I'll see you later. Look at that. Woo! Yeah, nice buddy. <laughs> It's time for Motor Guide Tackle Box. Hey, that's a great fish, Leo. Hi, I'm Grant Mills with today's Tackle Tip. Folks, I just want to tell you a little bit about the baits and the rods and reels and such that we're using down here at Mateos. 
One of the favorite baits that we use in today that uh, seems to be working well for Leo is the Terminator buzz bait. My favorite is the spinner bait, the Terminator spinner bait. When you come down here, folks, you've got to have a good rod, you've got to have a good reel, and you've got to have good line. And that's why we're using these R-type reels, R-type rods, and we've brought with us this 65 pound suffix performance braid line. I'll tell you what a great combination for landing these big bass down here in Mateos. Now let's get back to that action because I need some help and I'm getting my butt kicked out there. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, buzz me. Oh, fuck. Oh, look at this. Oh, don't get stuck. I got it. Amazing the power these fish have when they come up and hit that bait. Just explode on it. Not just trying to catch it, but trying, to, trying to kill it. Kill it. <laughs> Guys, look at this. What's he laughing about? Oh, like he's coming here. to show us a oh. fish he caught. Come finally here. Caught one. <laughs> yeah, he finally caught You're one. You're not going to believe this. Wait, let hey. me guess. Let me oh. guess. You finally caught a fish. No, better. Way better. We're driving to meet you guys, okay? We're, I turn around, eh? He, I go, Glendy, Glendy. He goes, what? We turn around, look at this. This, okay, you're making fun of my swim bait, right? No, I'm making fun of the side of your swim bait. My look side? At look at this. <laughs> look at this, and look at this. Look at, look at this is what it's eating. Wow. Look at, that is still alive. That fish is still alive. We see it swimming. Look, this is my, this is my nine inch swim bait. Okay? The guys were laughing at me. I haven't caught anything on it but they're still laughing at me. Okay, you know what? I, I, I take it why. back. I'm not going to make fun of you using a nine inch swim bait. I wonder what is going on. I got to pull this out. Oh, it's stuck in it. It's stuck in, it was stuck in his mouth. It's, it's lodged in its throat. Here we go. Oh, look okay. at that thing still alive. <laughs> Tilapia, still alive. Fish, still alive. Look. Ah, uh, you're telling me that there's big fish in, 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 in Mateos? This is uh, what, seven, eight? There's 10s, 12s, 14s eating bigger bait than this. <laughs> We're going to let this one go. Watch, watch this. Poor little guy gets to live. Look, watch. Uh -huh. goes. See you later. Oh I'm going to see if I can get this one to re revive. Well, all right. We're going to keep fishing. Tell you what, you stick with your 9-inch swim bait. Let me know how it works out. I'm going to let you know how it works out because if I get one, it's going to be double the size of this one. <laughs> Come to Mateos. Look at this. Joke. Bring some big swim bait. Oh, got me right there. Oh, look at the size of the thing. Nice fish there, buddy. Nice fish. Boy, did he ever pounce on that. Look at the size of the Just hit the stick. What do you see the size of this thing? Oh! <laughs> see that? It almost came in the boat. I hit a stick. Look at him. Oh. That thing just exploded when he set the hook. I hit the twig. And I come off, I thought it was getting snagged, and then all of a sudden it boom. He flew in the air so fast. He ate it. Look at him. He ate that big buck. Oh. i tell you what, that's one of the most acrobatic fish I've ever seen. Oh, man. Oh, oh. Woo -hoo. wanted that. It's going to be a tricky one to get. Oh, he ain't done yet. He wasn't getting off, buddy. Did he ever want that? Oh! <laughs> I didn't see nothing. Thanks, bud. I didn't see a fish. My first fish of the morning. What does he do? Tosses it in the lake. <laughs> he bit me. He bit you. How did I drop that fish? That's going to be a blooper. He came up and just engulfed oh, it. Oh, did he ever, bud? Wow. He just annihilated it. That was a. Whoa, look at this. Oh, first cast back in again. Oh, look at this guy. That's my fish. <laughs> Oh, oh, oh. Come <laughs> How come Ron's over there laughing at us? <laughs> oh, this is the biggest one of the day, bud. No way. 
biggest one of the day. Oh yeah. Look at the size of this guy. That's a 10. What? I can't even lift him. Lift the no, trolling no, motor. Lift the trolling motor. Lift the trolling motor. I got him. I got him. <laughs> I got him, Leo. I got him. <laughs> Look at the size of that what pig. A moose. Woo. That's a moose, buddy. And I'm telling you, you he that, ripped my uh, arm off. Guy. You lucky dog. See that guy. Got him. Wow. <laughs> Now that is a Lake Mateos largemouth right there, baby. Whew. Look at the size of that thing. Isn't that beautiful? I'm telling you right now, folks, Lake Mateos beauty right here. That thing's got to go 10 pounds easily. Yep, 10 pounds, buddy. Yeah, nine, nine, nine seven. eight. A nine, eight. How's that for Lake Mateos beauty right there? Ow. He just bit me. I told you he was biting me. What do you think I was joking? He was chomping on my hand. See you later. How's that for a fish, buddy? Oh, bud, that was a nice one, man. I'll tell you what, guys. Persistence pays off on this lake here. I had one earlier on a spinnerbait come up, hit me once, and then flashed at it. About the same size. I said, you know what? There's got to be fish here. You just got to keep working away, working away, working away. They're sitting on that structure, and eventually one of them comes up and comes up with a vengeance. Look at him, look at him pumping, eh? He's just a pumping. He's a pumper. He's a pumper. <laughs> <laughs> Engine number nine pumping. Okay, oh, watch this. live release. What's that? Why did I go sideways? There we go, buddy. Yeah, it's a good fish, bud. Good fish. Oh, he's a giant. Oh, he's just in the corner, Greg. Oh, get the net, cow. get the net, get the net, get the net, get the net. The net, the net, the net. Last fish of the day, and he's in. Ah. <laughs> Right on, Buddy, nice. What a way to end the day. Look at that. Lake Mateos. Woohoo! Buddy, this is absolutely incredible. You, you got to get out here and experience this, guys. It's been an absolutely fantastic day. Grant, you were a great to fish with today, man. I, oh, really I had a great you. time, buddy. I really appreciate you inviting me down here. Oh, look at that. That's a beautiful fish. Isn't that awesome? What a way to You know what the good news is for me? I get to do this all over again because watching this drove Ron crazy all day and he wants to film another show tomorrow. Yippee for me. Until next time, I'm Leo Stackles. And I'm Grant Mills. Grant Mills, take care, buddy. Yeah, you too, bud. Roddy, until tomorrow, bud. <laughs> there we go. Yeah. Woo. Yeah. Fish TV has been brought to you in part by PJ's Pets. Next to you, we're your pet's best friend. And Frayville, innovating the outdoors. Ow! Just bit me! Ow! Ow! Just bit me! Ow!